Good morning from the confessional. One of my favorite passages in all of scripture is when a couple of John the Baptist disciples are walking behind Jesus and Jesus turns around and he looks at them and he says, what do you seek? Right? And they have to figure out and think like, what is it that we seek? And they end up saying, Rabbi, where are you staying? Right? That they don't want to seek anymore. That they realize that they've found what their hearts are looking for. Right? Seeking is, is, is a verb, right? It's an action that you're, that you're longing for something. You're reaching out for something. And he says, what do you seek? From them to say, where are you staying? We want to come to this point and we want to stop and be able to rest and be with you. To say, where are you staying? Means that we want to stay in this place. We don't want to have to seek anymore. Now, why am I bringing you this message from the confessional? Because I think... 99.999, actually, no, I'll say 100%, 100% of the time, the things that we end up confessing over on the other side, we're confessing the results of seeking something from our heart that isn't what the Lord is asking of us. Why is it that we seek? Why is it that we seek outside of the boundaries that God puts for us within his love? The reason why is because we aren't trusting that he is actually going to fulfill us. I think the place that we end up realizing that it is safe and that it is beautiful for us to say, Jesus, where are you staying? That's where I want to stay. I don't want to seek outside of you. I don't want to seek outside of you and have to end up here, right? Now, just a little plug for confession. We all do it at times. So if you have found that you are seeking, please come here. I would love to hear your voice from the other side of this. Um, but... I think the way that we do this is by daily taking time to pray about, Lord, where at the end of the day, Lord, where or beginning of the day, either way, to think about them the previous day. Lord, where have you been with me? How have you been loving me? To say a prayer of gratitude and to truly think about all the blessings that God has given us. Because when we're aware of those blessings, we'll realize all we need to do is stay with the Lord. The things that we seek, he gives it to an even greater abundance. So, please today at some point, and tomorrow at some point, and the day after that at some point, say your prayer of gratitude to realize that God gives you what you seek. That way in those other moments when you're tempted to seek outside of him, you can stop yourself and say, no, Jesus, where are you staying? Where can I find you right now? That is where I truly want to be. God bless you.